Hi guys, it's me Terry of the Yarn Joy podcast. I wanted to make a video for you today uh, showing you the things that I got for Mother's Day and also I put together a few clips and picture, uh, yeah, pictures of things that I took when we went on vacation um, last week. We went on a little family vacation. It was combination celebrating the end of our homeschool year. Uh, also, uh, Mother's Day, uh, I did. we did take my mother with us along so she, as our gift to her for Mother's Day. And also, our wedding anniversary was during that time as well. And so, um, I want to show you the place that we went and um, just share that with you <laughs> and that's it so let's let's start this uh, video okay <laughs> okay so for Mother's Day I had a very nice Mother's Day um, my husband got me this beautiful card right there very pretty it's got some sparkles in it okay and then also my son and daughter-in-law came over for dinner uh, that day and brought me this my daughter-in-law does uh, embroidery working work she just has started doing um, little projects and she made me this little framed piece that she stitched on mom <laughs> very pretty she she finished it off really well and so I'll be hanging it here in my craft room so that I can see it <laughs> Okay, and my son, he made me this card, and he drew it himself. He is an artist. Besides an artist, he is an art teacher as well. <laughs> and then inside the card, he says, Like a fingerprint, all the wonderful things about you has left an imprint on our lives like no other. And then he signed it him and his wife signed it and then inside there he made me this which I am definitely gonna get framed and it's supposed to be like a big fingerprint okay and he has my name in the center and he has two hearts for my two sons and then he has all these different words that uh, when he thinks of me he said that he thinks of these different um, terms or words uh, some of them are like of course right up there at the top it says chocolate <laughs> um, and then he put in a few little uh, things like food that I, certain types of recipes we had names for uh, there's one called we always called it stuff with biscuits on top <laughs> and I used to make it a whole lot when the kids were home or when he lived at home also and um, so he put that, I thought that was really funny, he put that up at the top right there. <laughs> um, also he put uh, Fur Mama because I have my little fur baby dog <laughs> and Teddy which is the name of the dog and he put uh, roses, he put um, hummingbirds which I used to collect hummingbirds, I have quite a few still around the house. <laughs> um, he put um, library, homeschooling, things that he remembered doing with me when he was uh, young. And then he put uh, beach, seagulls, because I always like to go to the coast for our vacations. Uh, and then he, of course he put crochet, yarn joy podcast, and then different types of uh, words, adjectives that he thought described me. Um, in his mind you know <laughs> and let's see he put YouTube <laughs> and then he put um, uh, teacher artist daughter wife um, just a lot of sweet things anyway like I said it's things that he thought um, reminded him terms that reminded him of me <laughs> so I'm really I'm going to treasure that always and I definitely want to uh, get a nice frame and, and put it put it in there so that's what my older son and daughter-in-law gave me and then my younger son okay so what he did him and his girlfriend uh, they decided that they were gonna cook dinner for me and so um, my younger son was like the sous chef and my in his girlfriend um, 
they cooked and they made the whole entire meal including dessert it was a tres leches cake from from scratch okay that's um spanish for three milks cake i don't know if you're familiar with that but it's a very good um calorie laden rich <laughs> dessert but very very yummy and so uh she like i said they made tacos and and all the trimmings to go with it and then the cake for dessert and um so it was a wonderful time we all ate together and so it was a very nice mother's day okay so uh i think that's it that i was going to share with you about Mother's Day. Uh, now I will insert the clips and pictures that I put together showing uh, a little view of our little vacation that we took, okay? Hi everyone, this is Terry from Yarn Joy Podcast. I came down with my family just for a few days to um, come down to the coast and sit and relax. Of course, I did bring my crocheting with me. <laughs> um, we're having a good time. I'm sitting here this morning drinking my coffee, and this is my view. This is part of the Texas coast. Uh, this is just the bay, um, not the Gulf of Mexico, but um, it's a very nice little place that we are staying at. So I just wanted to show you the view. We're having a fun time, uh, very restful, and um, having a nice day today. Uh, we may get some rain coming in tomorrow evening, but we're hoping that today and, and most of tomorrow will have good weather for us while we're down here. So that was our little uh, vacation uh, getaway that we went for a few days last week, and um, we had a great time. Uh, I'm sorry my filming is not that great. I, I, after, when I was putting the clips together, I realized I should have held the phone the other direction instead of, you know, like landscape instead of portrait. So I know it's got the black bars on the side for several of the clips. Um, some of the clips my husband took, and so he did a whole lot better with with um, with those. You could probably pick those out. <laughs> but anyway, um, I just wanted to share with you our little getaway, and um, I think that's all. I hope everybody is enjoying your weekend if you're watching this on a weekend. <laughs> and uh, we will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.